Hello everybody, it's Monkey Schools here, and I'm showing you how to build a Lego Juggernaut from Call of Duty Black Ops, or World at War Zombies, whatever. I don't know if it's in World at War, actually, but it's in Zombies in Call of Duty. <laughs> I don't know why I need to tell you this, but I'm going to show you how to make it now. These are the pieces you will be needing. Sorry if the screen went on right there, I don't know if it did, but you need... One white 2x4, three red 2x4s, one red 3x2, and then seven red 2x1s, and two white 2x1s. Okay, first, take that. That's the bottom of it. Next, you need three of these. Put it right there, right there, and then right there. If I put it on, so it looks like this. And then take your two by three, put it on this back one right here, and then take two more two by ones, and then put them on like this on the sides. And then hit this top one off apparently. Okay, you won't do that when you build it. And then take your 2x4s, stack them on top of each other, and put them on right there, like that. And then put the white 2x4 on the very top. And I guess you can tell what's happening next, but do 2x1s, stack them on top, put them right there. And apparently break this. Okay, sorry about that. It's hard to build with one hand. But you do this. So it looks like this. And you really only need one of these. For the actual one. Put it right there. But I like to put this one on. Just because it seems more complete. Although in the game. It really does not look like this. It looks more like this you'd like to just do that, but I like to have this white one on. I do not know why, but I just do. So that is it for this Lego Juggernaut. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Subscribe, please, and like, and then comment if you want me to make some Lego stop motions. I can do that. Probably won't be the best thing you've ever seen. But it will still be pretty good. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.